a beautiful, wholesome atmosphere to be greeted by loving people who want to introduce them to horses, like for horse lovers. They want to be in competitive games or for toddlers, there was a bounce house or an activity maze. Just fun, a way to get outside, be with your family. There's something I think for everyone. Over 80 volunteers helping with everything from baking items for the bake sale to prayer warriors to helping with parking and running the games and serving and cooking the food, just selling tickets. Our dual mission is ending violence against our girls and women. I know I felt like I was alone on an island and there was just no one to help me. No one. This is the legacy project for Jesse Blodgett. And we use powerful, personal, local stories to do that with a local impact and a global reach. I absolutely love this project and think it's super important to get the word out about this resource that we have here. When I think of what the Love is Greater Than Hate project stands for, ending domestic violence and um, changing culture and um, promoting love over hate. I got pregnant with our daughter Riley and that's when he started getting physically abusive. Um, strangulation, um, hitting me, pretending to, or acting like he was gonna run the car off the road and kill us all. Love Greater Than Hate gave me a voice that I didn't even know that I had. And just all the times that me and Buck have talked and worked through it, I mean, it is an amazing organization and the louder we keep talking about domestic violence and how serious it is, the better. It humbles me and I am literally in awe. There's something so special about the family at Cedar Springs and how they come together and serve. I've never seen anything like it. They show up and they work so hard and they do it with such love. We were blessed also with volunteers from the Volunteer Center in Washington County. Pastor John, I mean, it just, everybody pitched in and rolled up their sleeves from the executive director, Buck Blodgett himself, on down the line. There were 12 year olds who signed up to volunteer. I mean, just beautiful. Our project has always existed to presence love anywhere and everywhere in our homes, in our parenting, in our schools, in our churches, in our work environments, everywhere. 